Hello there, this is Dan. Today I'm going to explain you how to create a function that returns true or false if in the cell there is a specific word. To fully understand, I will explain you first its number function. The cell is number function return true when a cell contains a number and false if not. We will test this function with the skew number in this list. My function is equal to is number parenthesis a2. As we can see, the function return false for all the skew that contain letters or alphanumeric values, and true for all numeric values. You can wrap other functions and formulas inside is number to test the result. To check if a cell contains specific tests, you can use the search function together with the is number function. For example, we can do something like this: is number parenthesis search parenthesis substring comma test in close parenthesis. Substring is a specific test you're looking for, and test represent tests in the cell you're testing. This formula returns true if the substring is found and false if not. Let's put this in practice. In this real example, the manager of the store wants to check all the titles of our products that contain the word WPT. Using the formula that we just mentioned, we can do this task very quick. My formula will be something like this equal to is number parenthesis search quotation mark in this case is WPT comma and we will put the cell that we want to test in this case is the title as you can see the result of this formula is true for all the titles that contain the word WPT and false for all that is missing that is work. I hope you liked this tutorial. If you did, do not forget to like and subscribe for more weekly updates. Thank you and have a good day.